Hi, I am Dr. Karanjit Singh Narang. I am a neurosurgeon. I am working as an associate director in the department of neurosurgery at Medanta Hospital, Gurugram, India. So I am a neurosurgeon and my basic work involves operating the brain and the spine. We at Medanta offer a comprehensive, comprehensive solution for brain tumors. We have the entire facility to investigate the brain tumors. That includes a pre-operative CT, MRI, a PET scan if required. And uh, we do surgery over here in the state of art operation theaters where we have intraoperative uh, neuro navigation. We have intraoperative MRI, one of the first centers in the country to have it. And one of the very few centers around the world we have it. Where while doing the surgery when the craniotomy has been done, we can do an MRI on the patient and see if there's any remaining tumor or not. And if there is, we can in the same sitting remove that tumor. Uh, otherwise, what used to happen was we used to operate, send the patient home, get the MRI done and then see there's a tumor and then call back again for surgery. So in this system, we can do it in one go and do a complete surgery. And after surgery, we have a very good uh, neurocritical care unit where who handles our patients and then a rehabilitative facilities for these patients. We have a dedicated neuropathology system for diagnosing these tumors. And after that, we have a dedicated uh, neuro radiation and neuro chemotherapy units to take care in case it's a cancerous tumor. So surgeries over here for the brain are done by using a microscope, a drill, a craniotomy is done. We have minimally invasive techniques also and we do endoscopic techniques also, especially for the pituitary glands where we use operate it through the nose rather than going from above. The surgery with the use of this technology has become more and more less invasive. The incision size which was previously this big for a surgery in the right frontal part of the brain has now become this big only. So that the scar is less, the post-operative stay is less and the patient goes home early. Apart from brain, I also do a lot of minimally invasive spine surgeries also. Patients with degenerative or traumatic or spinal tumors, I operate them a lot, especially for the cervical and the lower back or the lumbar region. We do navigated spine surgery just like for brain. We have a neuro navigation system for the spine also, where we can see exactly in real time where we are, how are we positioning our screws, are they not touching any nerves. We have a neuro dedicated neuro monitoring system so that we do not damage the nerves. So we have got very good results and a very large series of cases done for minimally invasive uh, surgeries for degenerative disc disease, uh, lumbar spondylolisthesis, low back ache. We also do a lot of uh, non-invasive techniques like uh, facet blocks, injections to take care of the pain in case the surgery is not required and we have a uh, dedicated rehabilitation facilities for the spine patients also. We do the cervical spine also both anteriorly and posteriorly as and when required. Take care of disc replacements also are done. So as an all, we are able to afford, uh, we are able to give uh, total uh, neurosurgical uh, facilities, surgical spectrum under one roof. The patient doesn't need to go out to get any test done, doesn't need to go out for any further investigations and rehabilitation. The entire thing from admission till discharge, everything is taken care of under one roof. And trust me, we are experienced team and we do everything which is at the moment being done around the world, less invasive state of art.